Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for January 3rd. It's for January 3rd. We're going to see whatever comes up. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Go ahead. Communicate. Tell them how you really feel. Do it. Express your love. January 3rd. Three, three, three. Three, three, three. Something's coming. Some sort, something is coming in. Here we have a birth and here we have a ship arriving. Something is coming in. But, but, there could be some hidden agendas with, with whatever is coming in. Could be, could be uh, not what you think it is. Right? That could absolutely be the case. Whatever's coming in may not be what you think it is. Really listen. Listen to what I'm saying. Okay? I mean, you may, you know, something is arriving, but it may not be, it may have some uh, hidden agendas, okay? So it looks like there's some kind of, somebody may not be telling the, the whole truth or revealing the whole truth. Maybe they're only telling you, you know, little, a little. They're just not telling the whole truth. They're just not revealing everything. There's a lack of communication here. There's a lack of togetherness. It's like somebody's not really... I don't think that somebody's revealing everything, but we do have um, some sort of something's coming in, something good, something new, the birth of something new. So let's see what else we have here. Oh. There's definitely some action being taken. Somebody is definitely coming. There's things are moving. They're moving. Um, it's been a long time. It's been a long time, though. But whatever, whatever is coming in, huh, I don't know why there would be hidden agendas. I mean, this is a something you manifested, but this is not. Or maybe you manifested the wrong thing, or who knows. I don't know how that can... Well, that can be from negative thinking. You can manifest the wrong thing from negative thinking, so... <laughs> this is an offer. This could be from a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, this is some sort of movement. This is a test. Of some sort. Hmm. It's funny because in the minor, in the minor, the nine of pentacles is kind of like the empress. So this is reverse. It's like there's a lack of abundance here, but there is abundance. So I'm wondering what's going on here. Lack of balance and harmony right here. A lack of victory, a lack of success. Things are out of whack. It's, they're like, you know, somebody's in a one-sided situation. They're thinking two people are not on the same page. That's what's going on here. Two people are not on the same page. What the hell is this? But there's love and stability. 
somebody's coming in with a, you know, wanting to start a relationship. Somebody is wanting to start a relationship. And they've been getting prepared to make this offer. And it's here, it's here. But it, you, it may not be what you, what you deserve. It may not be the offer that you deserve. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Yeah, somebody doesn't recognize, somebody doesn't recognize the truth. Somebody doesn't recognize the truth about a one-sided situation. There's really no togetherness. There's no teamwork. There's no collaboration. And it's like, get prepared for real love. Get prepared for real love. So somebody is, they could be, you know, wanting a soulmate, because this is a, the magician uses their power to call in a soulmate. And you remember, it's funny that I said about manifesting the wrong one. Don't let your loneliness lead you into the arms of the wrong one just because you're lonely. Maybe that's the test that needs to be passed. Maybe it's a test of your self-love. I don't know. Express, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Hmm. Maybe you're, you should just give it a whirl, whatever it is. Maybe you should. I mean, go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Just give it a whirl, but it doesn't look like, I don't know. This is, it's something is arriving, and it is a, a relationship. So a, a relationship, an offer of relationship is arriving, but with these cards right before it, it's like, maybe that's in the past because it's right before it. So maybe in the past it was one-sided. Maybe in the past this person didn't communicate and now they've come around and they're going to express their love because they're ready to have a new beginning, a new birth. Maybe in the past they had the past, they had the uh, hidden agendas and now they're coming with a solid offer after not recognizing and after not speaking the truth or after not who knows oops true love true love it's funny i just happened to grab that card this is true love is it after not getting what you deserve after not getting the recognition that you deserved This is the romance of a lifetime. Is that what it is? It's the, it's the romance of a lifetime. Somebody's made a decision to, to do something. The decision has been made to have a new beginning or to give up their independence for love. That could be, be certainly be the case. Or give up their independence to have a baby. That could certainly be the case as well. And that is true love when you have a baby. So somebody's, you know. And threes are your prayers being answered. And we have three threes here. So somebody's prayers have been heard. And they're receiving a new offer. But they may fear hidden agendas. There's some hidden agendas here, whether it's a fear of hidden agendas, or there was hidden agendas, or there was hidden agendas in the past, or there's something that is uh, a little bit sneaky, okay? There is. There's something, go there's something shady going on here. Well, I don't know what it is, but there is. There's something shady going on about something, whether it's happened in the past or it's happening now. Let's get some more cards. Let's get another card with that magician. Some shady behavior here. This person may have had some tricks up their sleeve in the past, and that's why they had to take a break. Maybe they weren't ready for a commitment, or they just didn't have the resources, or there was something, something. 
they didn't want it because this is remember they this is not manifesting this is manifest they just didn't want it in the past maybe it wasn't sneaky but this is becoming alive again lack of wish fulfillment lack of hope so this magician this person hasn't been able to manifest or hasn't been able to do something hasn't been able to receive wish fulfillment now they they want it now they want something solid They don't want to be alone anymore. They want a new beginning. So it's pretty much the same for the second and the third. Somebody, but it doesn't have the other person, so that's great. Somebody, somebody wants wants a new start. They want to they want to start something. But and it looks like they probably do have good intentions because it ends with this Knight of Cups. They want to have a relationship, but what what the hell is this? Lack of compromise, lack of lack of togetherness, lack of, I mean lack of putting in effort. There could be something in the way. This person doesn't want to make any changes. When we had this in the other reading that I did earlier today, I don't want to change. I don't want to change anything. I don't either. You know, so this is a problem. Um, anyhow, um, but anyway. Um, need to make a complex decision this yeah somebody needs to make a complex decision about whether they want to change or not are you really prepared for this are you really really prepared for this this relationship and maybe this is you deceiving yourself who knows this could go so many ways are you prepared for a relationship are you this is make that decision you have to make a decision you gotta you can't have both you can't you can't what's it gonna be you gotta find the strength and the courage and the confidence to grow, you know, to let go of ego, to be strong. You gotta find some sort of strength for some reason. You're strong. Looking at love. To to love. You gotta find the strength to let love in. It takes courage, you know. Perhaps why those cards are there is because you were with somebody who didn't put in effort. You know, and so now you're afraid to go down that new path. So, yeah, somebody has an opportunity for true love. But, you know, there's some, there's some fear. Fear of being deceived. Now, this could go a hundred different ways. We could do this reading for the next hour and I could change it a million times. Somebody has been get, getting prepared for love and it looks like perhaps it's here and now it's like I don't want to change I don't want to change anything but there's an opportunity for true love but you can't have any secrets I'm afraid, you know, somebody's afraid of getting distracted. Interesting. I don't want to I don't want to lose myself, my independence. Somebody doesn't want to lose themselves for love. They don't. I don't want to I don't want to lose that. So, hmm, interesting. One more card. One more card and then it's over. Oh, well. <laughs> Be strong. Be strong. Find the confidence to express your love and go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Don't. This is something that is very... capable of surviving this person has a lot of stamina look how far you've come look how far you've come 
whoever this is for. I don't know who this is for. You have an opportunity to, to ha get some help from one to two to get some help. And some decks it does bring two in to, you know, have somebody partner up with you. But you have to make that decision. There's a choice here. It's the answer to your prayers. What do you want? It's basically the same reading. It is. So yeah, there's an offer of love. It looks like it could be stable. It could be secure. It looks like there's definitely some fears in the way. And whoever this person was, you may have dealt with them in the past. You may have dealt with this person before. I'm not sure. I don't know. I mean, this can be for hundreds and thousands of people. But that magician's like, is there something sneaky about this? It's, there is. There is. But that could be yourself deceiving yourself. So... <laughs> A birth of true love. Give it a chance. Hard work pays off. If you can, if you can uh, put effort into it, I mean, hey. So anyway, I don't know who this is for, but there's an opportunity to go down a new path. But change is going to be needed. Somebody doesn't want to change. They don't want to change something. So there's going to be a, I think there's, is there going to be a conversation or what? This is something you can save. This is something that you can really save. This is a, this is something worth saving. This is something worth, you know, keeping. I don't know who this is for, but there's an opportunity for stability, security, love, but you may not be prepared for it. You're going to have to make a decision. Are you ready for change? Are you ready for change? That's what this is about. You might have to make, and this is, I don't want to compromise. I get it now. This is, I don't want to change. I don't want to make any compromises. I don't want to change. This is an opportunity of a lifetime. There's no hurry. There's no hurry at all. There's no hurry. There's no hurry with love. These are the best nights to get for that. I mean, there's no hurry. The slowest things are the, are the stablest, okay? The most solid, the most stable. So this, this is good. These are the best nights. These, this is what we want. Slow and steady in love. This is restrain. Restrain yourself. Take your time. Take your time. So I don't know who this is for, but uh, good luck.